Hello guys, so today I'm gonna talk about conservation machine. Alright, so my site is at Cable College Chapel, Oxford, UK. I decided to do a conservation machine for this place because I have this concern for listed building one and I study this building, it has so many sculpture, it has polychromy bricks, it has so many elements that need to be conserved from outside and also not just outside but the inside as well. It has various different of sculpture and the inside we have like stained glass, painting, the floor and then the furniture and stuff right. So everything it needs to consider important to conserve and to maintain and there is a funding for this project every year or two and then throughout the context there is also other building that considered as listed building one in conservation status so i decided my concept for this is conservation machine and throughout the process there are many case study many kind of like iteration that that be done for example like addition subtraction relocation transformation and also replication but throughout all the iteration what i see that picks interest of me to proceed my project is actually the transformation augmentation whereby i look into how the space transform and how the space move for the Kiva College machine. From this augmentation transformation, I did learn that when we make architecture structure movable, it gives an opportunity for us to reach to another level and then we can make something that are alive and then it can save space and it gives a much more meaning towards the space and by that, I want to develop more from the augmentation transformation and the things that I learned from previous iteration exploration. So I see that actually to pursue this project, modular structure is the best way to pursue this project. It is because it can be deployed not just this building that is uh, that are listed building one, but other building around Oxford as well. But using Kiba College as the starting point. As you can see from the ground floor plan, so the idea for, I mean the only access that to the first floor plan is actually the stairs that near to the entrance and all the bench uh, in the church is connected with the pulley system that it can lift all the bench up creating a very open floor plan for conservation activities and also church activity to happen. And it creates this bonding between visitor and the conservation specialist. As you can see from the first floor plan, you, it's actually a display area, a storage area, and also a workshop. A workshop that it can be changed to many different kind of like workshops such as timber workshop, it can become a steel workshop and also textile workshop and other conservation activities as well. So it divided it in the middle as a place where all the storage and display happening while the furniture it can be assembled and dismantled to suit the conservation activities and what activity are there at the moment. Alright, as you can see from this section the section tells that the conservation machine structure is movable through the arrow diagram while the section on the below shows the different configuration for different spaces usage. And by this, you can see that the conservation machine structure is contrast because of its carbon fiber in white color that contrasts with the red polychromy brick. And for the another section, you can see that there is a aerial work platform on outside to allow visitor to reach to a higher level for the sculpture. 
and same goes to the elevation all right for the conservation machine aerial work platform it served from the front and also the back of the the chapel which it has two different aerial work platform module which one is using track and one is using tire some may ask like how i come up with this design strategies so it start when i feel that i need to learn I, I need to take a step back a bit for the process which i decided to learn like how how to create a very flexible module so i decided to learn about chinese mortise system which it can be assembled like from a small module when i repeat it so much that it it creates this inefficiency of structure distribution and that makes me realize that i need to design the module system differently uh, for the column it has different type it has base structure it has uh, it has the pulley system and also it has the roof using the module advantage so it can be it can be configured into a different kind of like conservation activities with a different configuration for the modular structure starting as simple as design uh, assemble the furniture first for different kind of like activities so since the material for the the structure is carbon fiber and it is very lightweight and the size of it is not big so it can be dismantled to the scale that human can bring along to other spaces and transport it to other places as well as an evidence to prove that it can be dismantled to a very small scale even the furniture itself such as the storage system it can dis be dismantled to the scale that human can bring along to other places all right for the one strip section you can see how the detail works for the structure and on the right side you can see the detail zoom in and this is to show the different module in the conservation machine and this is the conservation animation how the assemble happens in the conservation machine And this is the display storage and workshop during day and night. And this is the gondola for the conservation specialist and visitor to reach the unreachable spaces. And this is the visitor on the ground with the conservation specialist. They learning and also interacting with each other. And this is the gondola on the front and rear of the Kiva College Chapel and this is how the aerial work platform works and this is the section that tells the activity on overall view what happening during day and night since the architecture itself is movable it's transformable it create this opportunity of the activity itself can be transformed can be changed can be adapt and yeah taking example as the conservation activities happening at the same time with the performance wire performance it just create a beautiful architecture thank you